I'd, I'd return here every evening, especially in the springtime where the flowers were in blossom and the children's laughter careered around the wall. Sometimes, sometimes I would just stop outside the gate, listening back against the wall, the cool, thick wall that held the family together, safe. Bringing the production into school today was important because um, it feels a little bit like we live in a bubble where we are in this community um, at times. You know, we haven't got um, a hugely diverse community. Um, we don't have a huge number of migrants in the area and our students are at risk of not being fully aware of, of the issues. The day that changed everything, I heard a new noise, not of this courtyard earlier. And then the first shell hit, maybe a block away. There's, there's a lot of mileage um, in bringing in productions like this so that students are aware of the wider world. And when um, I was offered this opportunity via our deputy head, I, I kind of snapped his hand off within an hour, I think, um, and, and we jumped at it, and, and it was definitely a good decision. The sound was so overwhelming because I could not piece that noise into this place. It did not fit. What I would say to another, another colleague in another school if they were presented with an opportunity to get something like this into the building would be don't just consider you know, financial implications if there are some. Um, consider the impact it could have on your cohort in terms of the way they think um, as rounded human beings as well as just your, your kind of broad curriculum um, kind of restrictions um, and really seriously think about the positive benefits it could have on the students. And then without me taking a further breath, shell that shook out courtyard threw me out into the street and changed everything in a second of unimaginable chaos.